we have Woolworths, Taste Test, Apricots, Australian local produce. Let's find ourselves a ripe, tasty apricot. This one, oh, here we go. That's a ripey. No smell. Woolworths fruit rarely has any smell. Look. Totally tastes. Totally tastes. And that's a ripe apricot. Bottom line, crap fruit 100% of the time. Don't waste your time. So we have new season, in season nectarines. Let's try one out. This one nice and soft. A little bit of smell. Tart, bitter, yet it's ripe. It's ready to eat, but like what are these people doing? What are they growing? Crazy. Have lychees, local lychees, 17 bucks a kilo. Nice red, that's what we're looking for red. Good. It's got like a chemical dimethylate taste. I put money on that. These lychees contain banned chemicals that are banned in the US and banned in Europe. Totally tasteless. Rubbish. Now what you can get is lolly bananas that are full of gelatin and they've got five times the calories of normal banana and they're only two dollars 300 grams so you get almost a pound of bananas for around three dollars Australian so it costs you more for real bananas versus fake bananas would have gelatin in there yeah let's look at the ingredients gelatin probably might not show up there but gelatin is basically the hoofs and penises and scrotums and skin from cows and pigs and sheep it'll show up if you bring it closer a bit no, it says beef. Gelatin. It says the beef gelatin. And then, but, yeah. So, we've confirmed Woolworths has no quality fruit, rarely, but if you look down here, we've got a whole aisle. Show the viewers the aisle of... So that's where you get your calories from. Aisle of sugar. Aisle of sugar. And colours. Crazy. That's where it belongs on the fucking floor. Woolworths call themselves the fresh food people. I say it should be called the crap expensive fruit. Yet cheap lolly people.